Hey, I'm Max Michelle. We're here at the U.S. Steel Shoot in Titusville, Florida. Alongside with me, I have BJ Norris. Uh, BJ, you know, you, yesterday you shot the 22 rimfire event. Today you're shooting a limited event, and tomorrow you're shooting the open. Now, I know you probably didn't have your performance that you were looking for yesterday in the 22. How did that affect what you did today, and how did you do today? Well, mainly what I was trying to do today, Max, is, is come out. You know, I, you like you said, I didn't have the best performance yesterday like I was really looking for. So today I just tried to start over, reboot, and uh, get clean, consistent runs all day long. And, and that's uh, pretty much what I did. And I feel pretty good about the way I shot. Excellent. So what, do you have any idea what your overall score would be today? Uh, it looks like without flight time added, it's going to be right around 89 and 3 quarters, something like that. Okay, what's the current record for whether it be U.S. Steel Shoot or the, the World Steel Challenge? What is the current record for a limited gun? I think it's somewhere around 92, but I'm not 100% sure. Okay, so you must be pretty happy with what you did today, right? Yeah, so you know, for those out there wondering, limited guns are basically guns that, uh, you know, have some modifications done to them, but they don't have compensators, they don't have optic sights, they're a bit more of a stock type of a pistol gun so it's pretty uh, pretty impressive that he was able to draw from the holster and fire 195 targets successfully in uh, just under 90 seconds it's pretty impressive so now with that with your performance what you did today obviously was great how are you going to carry that momentum or what are you going to do differently tomorrow because not only are you shooting the open division tomorrow but you also have the uh, help me out here Steelmaster. the steel master right uh, on the line as well well, I think, uh, as, as you know too, the, really the best strategy is to come out and try and get good, clean, consistent runs and, and hit the targets, you know, five through five and not take a bunch of extra shots. So really that's going to be my strategy tomorrow is just try and do the same thing. You know, works good today, so we'll see how it works uh, tomorrow. Excellent. So, and the Steel Master was all three events, right? Rimfire, Open, and Limited, all you're adding your all score. Um, just one more quick question that I have on that is, how, how does that affect your training leading up to this event when you have to fire three different handguns? I still mainly focus on the open division uh, since it is the overall title. Um, I train enough for the other guns to make sure they're functioning, make sure everything's set up the way I like it, and then mostly just re reserve those until the day before the match. Excellent. Good idea. Now, uh, if uh, the people at home or anybody on the website want to find out more about you, where can they find out more about you and your sponsors? Uh, the easiest place to go is on Facebook. Uh, just search BJ Norris and I should be the first hit. Excellent. Well, good luck uh, tomorrow and congratulations on your win today. Thanks, Max. Good luck. Again, this is Max Michelle alongside with BJ Norris at the U.S. Steel Shoot in Titusville, Florida, and you're watching this on sightpicture.co. Stay tuned for more product reviews, interviews, and competitions right here on sightpicture.co. Please remember to subscribe for weekly updates.